Hello, Michael J. Fox. I'm Joseph Becker. I just want to say to you, you did pretty good doing the voice of that mouse, Stuart Little. He's a smart mouse, and he's pretty good. He's good at going out on adventures, and, and a smart guy who can f defeat a villain on his own. I was like, wow, a mouse that can defeat a cat or a falcon or the beast in the movie Call of the Wild. So that was pretty good. And I like you were Marty McFly who goes on adventures in the movies of Back to the Future. Using that car as a time machine. I like when you go into the Wild West and see the Indians and meet a family and fight against these rebels in the bar and then outside the bar until the doc saved you. And uh, like at the end of that movie, you were on the train, the moving train, trying to get this time machine guard to work and get back to the future. And you were good. So I was thinking, if you were good in those movies, you could do the voice of me in my movies, like the seven movies of me played by you. A movie that I was going on an adventure to find my bike that's been stolen by this guy named Francis. Like, Pee Wee Herman had lost his bike and tried to find it, and I, I'm the one who's going to go find my bike and get it back into the Hollywood by Kevin Morton, that little kid. And I was disguise myself as a pretty person and get that bike and be chased by these guys that are on like carts like a golf cart on bikes and motorcycles and go through all the plays like a beach play, the Santa play, Godzilla play and then by chased by a car with the band Twisted Sister through the jungle with Tarzan and I would be swinging on this jungle vine with my bike screaming like him and then jump over a fence with the rockets and also at the end of this movie of mine I'd be saving pets from a pet shop that's on fire the dogs birds ducks mice fish and the snakes too carrying them in my hands I'll be, no, I'm not afraid of snakes. I'll just carry them with my eyes closed and make sure they don't bite me and then drop them. And I can make you do the voice of me in this other movie like I was a mall cop for Paul Blart by this guy named Kevin James and I would take control of this more this more control scooter in a mall as a mall cop and wearing a white uniform, a black tie, and see if there's any problems going on in the mall. And I can let you be in this Armin movie that I like. It's an claymation Armin movie with cavemen. It's called Early Man. And I would be a caveman and be hunting rabbits with a spear. And I, because, you know, cavemen and cave women don't wear shoes. They be wearing... They just be barefoot all the time. And I like that movie that they hunt rabbits. So I was thinking if I was in that movie hunting rabbits, I'd be doing good. So if you do the voice of me and help me make those movies, I can help you make other movies that you're in. And I'll be in there with you because... I became this new actor here and because I've been listening to your scripts and your acting skills too. And you instructed me to be an actor. Mm -hmm. And I already became this new actor and a new film director and a film editor too. So I will be your director of movies and and your film editor too because I can add stuff like songs and some new scenes too. This is what makes me a film editor, a new one. So I'm making my Hollywood here in this new state for you to come and so as the other actors and actresses too. So 
if you all come down here, let's hope we work together to make my movies, 90 of them, and then we'll make lots of movies and make lots of money, too, all right? But I promise you, I'll make my movies and my Hollywood here in Indiana for you, Michael J. Fox, and we'll be friends forever.